open the Adobe Photoshop touch for phone and open a blank document make sure the width is uh, 1280 pixels the height is 720 now tap on OK so here already you have a lot of blank transparent background so now you tap on layer and add a new layer photo layer photo library and go and find the background that you want to add here I've already downloaded one which is really fit for me and there you can see now you want to scale it make sure that the background blind transparent background is covered now tap on tick button to see now tap on the layer tap on add new layer color layer color library and you're gonna add a phone frame like this but make sure that the phone frame is also in a transparent background so I will use the PixArt on the software on application on Android to make it so uh, if you don't know how to make this phone frame to be transparent make a nice frame uh, for your Android screen video then just go and click on the link down below this video you want to see that uh, the video that I already uh, show you how to do this okay so now I've got the phone in I'm gonna scale it make sure that I'm gonna scale it a little bit bigger so it's enough for seeing everything so now I'm gonna put it in, uh, in the middle of the background picture and tap on tick button okay now you wanna clear the background which is currently showing that the phone is there has a wooden background so you wanna remove that background wooden background and make sure later on you can fit the video screen the Android uh, screen video put it inside it so now what I'm gonna do is just uh, I'll tap on the layer button here then tap on the background tap on the layer background okay make sure you tap on that layer background you see choose it and now now you tap on this button or rectangular select okay select that rectangular and now you will draw a rectangular uh, kind of shape here okay make sure like that now tap on edit and tap on clear all right so uh, now tap on edit again and we'll tap desert to not select the tools anymore so guys right now you're gonna get you already get a background with a phone frame on that nice background with a phone frame on that so now the next step is you want to save this uh, background picture so you want to tap on this button here and you want to tap on save to gallery and choose the pic uh, choose the picture that you want to save to the gallery and choose the format that you want to save it and as here I'm going to save it as a PNG format so to make the mobile frames and the cute background to be fit in our Android screen video we need our uh, application name kind master so I've downloaded it from Google Play Store and now we're gonna go with that tap on this button and tap uh, in empty projects to start a new project okay now we're gonna tap on media browser where you're gonna add a uh, Android screen video I hope I have a record uh, some of the screen video here and let's say I'm gonna go with the that one I'm gonna go with uh, the small one so here I'm gonna go with it okay so I'm gonna tap on this button to make sure that it's already chosen now you will already get the videos inside that now you tap on layer tap on image to add a layer image layer now you will go and tap on Adobe Photoshop touch and find that picture that image and add it right now you want to scroll it until where it starts 
where the where this video starts okay cut it where the video stop all right so you see the phone is there and now we're gonna scale this uh, image to be in the full screen it fits in the screen of Kine. I think that fits already so now tap on that to already choose so now you tap on the video and tap on crop image and you want to crop that you tap on the start position and tap on the equal button and tap on the end position so guys you can see now it's already show that uh, so now you tap on the this button to make sure it's chosen already guys so now um, tap on this to make sure everything is chosen and we tap on the play button here video screen recording so the first part of the tutorial is to okay guys make that's it uh, now you can see already the background with the phone and everything is on so now you want to tap on the exist button or you want to tap on the uh, back button on your phone and wait for the uh, the video to be shown here so you want to tap on the video and you want to tap on the share button where you have an option to save the video